So I just got off work and have a free afternoon. Not long enough to fish for a long time, but enough time to at least check the ice at Strawberry. So I'm gonna meet up with the rest of the family. We'll drive up to Strawberry and we thought we would let the Utah Fishing Channel know how the ice is up at Strawberry. This tells you how much time we have. I haven't even changed yet. So we ended up getting to Strawberry just before the sun went down and had probably 20 to 30 minutes of actual fishing time. Unfortunately, I forgot my GoPro and this is one of those times where I wish that I would have had a whole filming crew because there was just so many cool things to see and so little time to fish. But regardless of the amount of time that we got to spend up there, I think we still got a good report of the ice and of the fishing at Strawberry. So we made it up to Mud Creek before the sun went down and we're looking at some not so frozen ice. It's frozen right up until about there and then it's open water. I don't know if you can see it very well, but there is some ice, enough that I'm just gonna walk out, not too far. So I'm gonna see if it starts cracking when I walk out on it. As you can see, I am still in my work clothes because I wanted to get up here fast enough to check the ice. We're definitely gonna keep the kids from going too far out on the ice, that's for sure. What do you think, you gonna go ice skating, Becca? No. <laughs> Here's the official thickness report for strawberry. We are not far from the shore though, so take this with a grain of salt here. But we are about four inches of ice where we're at. And the further I get out, the thinner the ice gets, needless to say, but it is getting quite a bit thinner. It's probably only about three inches now. I've hooked into and lost three fish. There's just way too much creaking on this ice for my comfort. So I'm in like two feet of water. You hear all that? I don't know if you can see, but I've got a big fish on here. And I'm just trying to get him in without breaking a line. Dang it, he's huge. This is the fourth fish I've hooked into and I keep losing them. Come on, fish. Come on, come right up out of there. <laughs> I've actually got him on my hands. I probably stupid, but oh, here we go. Come on. Oh, yes. But look at the size of that fish next to my shoe. Holy smokes. That guy is huge right there. Look at that. Wow. Okay. Let's let this guy go. He's out of there. Nice. We did it. Hooked three fish before he finally got that one. Holy smokes. And I am off this ice fast. I'm ashamed to say it, but this is what I caught the fish on. So we hooked like four fish and they were so big that one of them just broke my line. One of them snapped the line. Then I lost another two, finally got the last one. So short as it was, I think we had a pretty good evening.